on a Thursday. How do you like that? Good evening, everyone, and welcome to what should be the final episode, fingers crossed, of Alien Isolation. Assuming all goes well and we can get through all of those little uh, survivor mode maps. <clears throat> Based on our brush with them doing the very first one, I think they're generally going to be fairly short. I know that they are locked in normal difficulty. and. After playing through on Nightmare, frankly, the alien seems like an idiot playing on normal. Hey, Lone Wonder. Hey, DLF. Hey, Karis. Hey, Alice. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, everyone. I'm doing really well. I mean, obviously, I I finally got a job. I finally got a new job, so that's uh, it's got me in a good mood. I start on... August 26th, so have t suddenly there's a clock. There are 20 more days of fun employment during which I, I plan to stream as much as possible because then suddenly I'm going to have a lot of, a lot of real shit to do again. Not that, not that streaming's not real, but you, you know what I mean. Real life stuff. Yeah, Lone Wonder. Haven't been watching Discord, have you? It's all right. Uh, yeah, no, that uh, I got the offer and we cleared conflicts, so I start the twenty sixth. It's very exciting. Yes, we're fine. If all go if all goes well, we're finally going to be done with Karen. I think we've got ten of those little maps to do. So, I kind of want to get started because I want to get to I want to get to bed tonight because I have to wake up at five and go with my mom to watch my nephew. So we're kind of up against the clock, which is all the more reason to just get going. So the basement is the one that we already tried. Uh, so we'll do ransoms three maps next. Severance is up first. Optional objectives are to delete the server records disable the camera system, and seal the window shutters. Those ungrateful SOBs left me to rot to protect their investment. I'm getting out, and I'm going to make sure there's nothing for the vultures to salvage. As, so, uh, we, we've got options in all these, but I'm going to play as the character that, I guess, goes along with the story. And in this case, that's Ransom. We heard a lot of audio logs from him. He's the kind of slimy executive type. Nobody's clean, everyone's got a little dirt on them, you just gotta know how to use it to make them squirm. He comes with a revolver, a bolt gun, a level 2 security access tuner, a flare, and blueprints for the EMP and the noisemaker. Alright. Let's fire it up. Severance. Time limit, 30 minutes. Delete the server records, disable the camera system, seal the window shutters. So, I guess this must be Ransom's apartment. Dang, he was living pretty large. So let's see what all we can find. Just remember, you, you have your little preparation room. Where your goal is to get ready, and the timer doesn't start until you hit that button. I wonder if we're going to have androids to deal with, since he's starting with a bolt gun. Oh look, he's got Vidya! Yeah, 
It's such a strange feeling to actually find items again after getting so used to nightmare mode. All right, anything craft? EMP, noise maker. I can't outright make either one. I guess I'll hold off for now. All right, let's roll. Here we go. Well, that went poorly. Definitely noticed our boy starts with no flamethrower, which is a tough road to hoe. Yeah, the DLCs are stuck on normal, Lone Wonder. Shotgun shells. Not bad. really seem to be on me, but that was one of our optional objectives. It's just irritating for it to drop it on you, like, straight out the door like that. I mean, what am I supposed to do? Lose. I should have just restarted then. That clearly wasn't going to work. tough to operate without a flamethrower, I must say. <sighs> I can't seem to actually make anything worthwhile. How much fairer was that? Alright, that deleted the server records. Hey, Gunner. Hey, Cynic. Good to see you both. Uh, I'm doing really well. I, I got that job. We cleared conflicts. I start on the 26th. Um, well, Cynic, this is only the second DLC map. And yeah, they're all, uh, they're all new areas. They're all pretty self-contained. They're, uh, and they're all pretty small. Like... I think if, 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 I'm, if I'm careful, I should be able to chew through them pretty fast. I'm hoping to do all that's left tonight, fingers crossed. I'd like to... Not that, not that I don't enjoy it, but I'd like to be done with this game. Ugh. 
All right. Oh, hey, a shotgun. <laughs> Hi, Karen. Didn't miss you. She went back into the vents. Now she's somewhere behind me. Oh shit, a movie theater. Oh, balls! <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, they're face huggers. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> that was bad. Alright, well, we can run. We can run while we're prepping. Let's try and speed this up a little. Here we go. Okay. I do have a maintenance jack. Balls. Well, you know, we may not finish this tonight. <laughs> not if it keeps this shit up. Surprised ganking me with face huggers. Straight dropping Karen on me. When I have nowhere else to go and I don't have a flamethrower to run her off with. Hi, Karen. Go somewhere else. Please. Into the vents is good. I'll take it.
There's so many times in this game where it just decides, hey, fuck you, you lose. Like, if it drops the alien in the wrong place at the wrong time, there's nothing you can do. I suppose that's the fun of it. A sound that time you're supposed like if it's if it was one room over I'm supposed to be able to hear it drop out of the vents you guys didn't hear it did you like I'm not crazy and just missed the sound did I like, I've always been able to hear it when it drops out of the vents if it's close to me Okay. I'm glad I'm not. I don't like that the game is functionally letting Karen cheat, but... Jesus! It did it again! That's true, I do know she's cheesing, and... I think we can distract her with flares, right? That's a thing. Cynic, the answer is sort of, like, you're supposed to be able, you're at least supposed to be able to hear when she comes back out of the vents. And for some reason that's not happening in this DLC map, she just reappears silently. Which is what's screwing me up so bad. It's like, if I haven't heard her drop out of the vents, I've been trained to think I'm safe until I do hear her drop, you know? But they've taken away that sound, or more likely it's glitched away.
See? No noise. Probably should use my motion tracker, since it is an option now. I've just forgotten. I've gotten so used to not having the motion tracker from playing on Nightmare. I forget it actually works now. Hey, buddy! Okay, so it did equip me to deal with that fucking face hugger. I was just not paying attention. Like, at all. Where you at, you little shit? So it doesn't even spawn in the same spot. Well, that's gonna fuck with me. one. Hug this! Fucking right. I don't even care if I fail the optional objectives at this point. I just want to finish the map and get the fuck out of here. Oh hey, I got one of them. I sealed the window shutters. The only thing I couldn't do was, or didn't do, was disable the camera system.
I have a flamethrower now. Fuck you. I have alcohol and a flamethrower now. Fuck you even more. Yeah, the map will work now too, but I, d I don't have uh, I don't ha I haven't found the map yet. If I did, it would work. Fuck you! There's another one. Where? Where? Fuck you! <laughs> I hate face hunters. Maker could be handy. If you get there in time, that's the lever that disables the camera system. Just FYI. Hear a Karen in the vents. I have a flamethrower now. Hi, Karen. I see you. You're pretty far away, but I see you.
That was ridiculously uncool. That was right at the exit, and it literally just ganked me. That was horseshit. Oh well. Alright. I think I know the whole map now, so... It's also abundantly clear that I don't need to bother picking up the shotgun. Or, really, any of this shit that's not the flamethrower. So... Why bother? Maybe all the alcohol on principle. <laughs> That's BS. Thank you for supporting me, friends. I too believe that was a garbage, garbage kill. I'm not on board with that death. was wondering if I could actually distract it. Didn't even end up really mattering. Hi, friend. Best friend. Did you notice it didn't make the fucking face hugger noise? I just happened to see it in time. Holy fuck. seal the window shutters. Might actually be able to complete the objectives, now that I know where they are. And I think the alien... I don't think the alien is live in this window where we're dealing with facehuggers. Which is kind of interesting, to say the least. Buddy. Alrighty. Good, good, good. So this time we can disable the camera system. Hooray for finishing the optional objectives, I suppose. trying to pinpoint the moment the alien goes live again, and it seems to me 
that it's actually when we lift the security lock down. We clear a second route back to the elevator with this hack right here. Karen. Victory! Hey! Never detected! <laughs> Alright. Well, there you go. When we win, we win with, with style. Alright. Okay. Let's try the next map. Scorched Earth. They're going to be looking for a scapegoat for this whole mess, and Lingard's got files that could hurt me. I'm going to make them disappear. Save the civilian. Collect Lingard's research files and hack the exit to Lab B. Okay. <laughs> hey, Alex. Good to see you. Welcome back. We'll play as Ransom again. This... This first package is meant, meant to be played as him. It's like his little storyline, so. Gorched Earth. Here's the prep room. Start. Can't put any. Can't actually put anything together. <laughs> nice game. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, here we go. I guess Ransom's not all bad if he's going to try to save a civilian. Hey, yo, friendo! 
There's your game changer right there. Whew. But I don't have any ammo for it. Oh, hey, civilian. God, I thought that was the alien. Oh, I can't use it. Saved the civilian. be right there for the door to pop open. Thank you, Alex. I appreciate it. You were also thinking Ransom can't be all bad if he's saving civilians. Well, Jesus, Karen. Stop sweating me, girl. You're clinging. I need some space. Jesus, tap dancing. Christ, fuck on a cracker, where did she drop? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Thought I'd have longer. <laughs> oh, it sounded like she was right next to me again. Oh, man. Yikes. Oh yeah, yeah it, it never gets less tense, Alex. I would never claim that it did. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, mother of God, really? Where is she? I fucking heard her drop. Right outside. Okay, she left. Hey, Fangs! I'm sorry you're sober. Well, it's a, it is a Thursday, so there are, there are worse ways to be. Wait a minute, what? Those were the files. Right? Why didn't the objective complete? Those were the files. They were very obviously the files. That's weird. Hold on. Ooh. Oh, there's another file. How many fucking files are there? Great. That wasn't cheesy or anything. No. No, that's just fine. OK, 
Okay, we hacked the exit to lab B. Gonna be sober till next March. I mean, I think that's, I think that's a commendable thing. Any particular reason? Or just general health and wellness, which is always an acceptable answer. Right, well, okay, I know where almost everything is. As long as Karen just leaves me alone enough, re enough, we should be fine. At least we don't have to face this time. Go that way. That'd be great. Anywhere but here. Like, oh, she's right there. She's coming right for me. I'm trying to go. Go somewhere else, Karen. Please. In the vents. She's directly between me and where I need to be again. It's her favorite spot to be. Hey, you know what? Fuck off. It's only been a few days. Give it some time. Let the abs win more hockey games.
over behind me, like, where he's just, like, sitting there staring at the tutor and I can't fucking move. Right, well, I've concluded I don't need any of the shit in this room. It's not gonna be me. Right now. It did the same damn thing, just at the beginning of the time. That was cheese ball there when we were close to the end though. It's like, oh you can't move in time. You can hear, you can very painfully hear it drop in behind you. But we're not gonna let you move while he stares at his tutor. Alright, tell you what. Let's use the resources we have at our disposal. Try and distract it with a flare. What am I supposed to do if it doesn't even let me through the first door in time? Go to the flare, Karen. What I used it for. Go look at the shiny, shiny bright. Hey, bro. Clearly, if you're playing a character without a flamethrower, your first order of business is to get a flamethrower as fast as you freaking can. Hi, Karen. Go somewhere else, Karen. There you go. Bye bye. Door hit you in your ass on the way out. Fuck. I just hit the wrong key. That was dumb. There's one. Right inside Lab B again. Yes, of course. Right where I need to be. I have a freaking talent for that. It's almost like the game cheats. Oh, she went in the vents. Okay, good.
This is where we got ganked last time. Hey, we got all the research files. Good. the elevator. We're nearly done. I have to call it? Oh, that's no good. Yeah, of course. Go away. Go away. God's sake. I did wipe Lingard's evidence! The fuck do you mean? first walking by. This actually seemed to help. Last time. With the whole getting ganked at the beginning thing. It bought me some time. I mean, everything's always in the same place. Getting around Karen is fairly luck-based. But that's always the case. One thing I have noticed though is that Karen's drawn to even like the story noises. It's like when I complete one of the objectives or when the lab explodes, like it seems to flag her and she goes there. It's like if I get the fuck out in time and don't get spotted or make noise, then Karen winds up fucking around in the area I just got out of. Which is very useful to me. Karen, Karen, Karen. Where are you now? Not in here. the elevator on our way by. So that's gonna help. That will save time. Yeah, yeah, see? She wants to fucking gank me again. 
How about you go away? Leave. I need you to leave. But you're not going to do that for me, are you? There must be another way in. Okay. She left. Goody. Shit. Actually, log in after I hack it. There we go. Get to comms. Gladly. Would love to. Hey, Karen. You awful bitch. Goodbye. Yeah, this is this is still gonna take more than one stream. Just just FYI. Loose ends. The Torrens should be here soon, and it's my ticket off Sevastopol. I've just got to collect a little insurance on the way. No, Alex, that would not have been fun. <laughs> oh, I guess the elevator's stuck. Alright, well here's the prep room. This is the last mission in Ransom's little pack. Which I, I think it, I think this pack of this pack of three maps was the first DLC it's called like Corporate Lock. I think what's it called? Corporate Lockdown. Yeah, this was the first DLC pack. So No, it was it was neither. That was just Ransom's little mission objective to wipe it. Granted, I was in a bit of a hurry because Karen was right there. Okay. Find a way out. Oh, we got androids. Check it out, check it out, we got androids. I know what that shit means. My sensors are maxed. Oh, okay. Guess I'll start building an EMP mine then. Collect Nostromo log data. Lock down security junction. Disrupt communications. 
Knew it. <laughs> Fuck you, buddy. Walt! Hey, buddy! I'm good. I actually got that job. I cleared conflicts and everything. I start on the 26th. Yeah, I'm soon to be gainfully employed once more. And I gotta tell you, it's a good feeling. It's a good feeling. Okay. Uh, we're playing Alien, but you don't have to worry about spoilers. We're just in DLC land. You can hang out if you're so inclined. And the DLC isn't really story-based. It's just these, like, little self-contained maps. More charge packs. All right. I just need some bonding agent. And I can make an EMP mine. Which I want to do, because I know there's another android. Yes, bonding agent. Good. Bam. A haircut? Gonna be rolling in virtual dates. Yeah, you know. Because cause that's what's been on my mind lately. Hey! Guess what? Fuck you, buddy! Oh, fuck, another one? What are you doing here? Oh, balls. Commit to down there. Yeah, you know what? Fuck you, bud. <laughs> oh no, 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 Walt. It was it was a good joke. I appreciate you saying I look good. They were making fun of me because. You know, for the hockey playoffs, I do a, uh, I, I do, you know, my, my little attempt, oh, bolt gun ammo, there we go. That's all I need. Get over here. There we go. I am one of a team assigned to collect the Nostromo flight recorder. Well, I have failed at locking down the security junction. Yay. Okay, there I disrupted communications. No alien yet. Is this whole thing gonna be androids? Uh, yeah, Walt. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll sh if you want, I can show you after I finish this map. But they brought back the entire cast of Alien. They were all still alive when this game came out in, uh... 2014 and in the base game they all did voice work just on some new logs in so they and i, I mean all all seven i think seven maybe hold on let me count because they had they had parker and brett and lambert and dallas and ripley and ash and and kane yeah john hurt was the first to die but even he was still alive in 2014 so yeah all seven of them did voice work for the base game, and uh, one of the DLCs, or two of the DLCs, are set in recreating parts of the original movie. The One of them is, you play as, well, you, ha you actually have your choice of characters, but I played as Dallas to be sort of true to the movie. 
So in one of the DLCs, you play the sequence where Dallas is going through the vents with the flamethrower trying to trap the alien. And in another one, you play you play the end of the movie where Ripley sets off the self-destruct sequence and sneaks back onto the shuttle. That would have locked down the security junction had I done it in time. That's okay. I'm going to catch you. Is that a fact? Why not ask me about Sevastopol's safety protocols? Go in, go in, go in. Droids can't follow you in the vents. Of course, now the vent is my only way back in. That was short sighted. Anyway, I. I think I was talking about playoffs when I got distracted by the game and your question about the movie. Uh, so I stopped shaving on Sunday, or Saturday was my last shave, excuse me. So I, st yeah. So yeah, I stopped on Sunday. And they were making fun of me because you can't see any difference yet. Like, come on guys. It takes a little longer than that. Hey, I got the Nostromo log data. Word. Why not ask me about Sevastopol's safety protocols? Shave and a haircut. Oh, you want instant Moses beard? <laughs> well, see, the whole idea is the Avalanche just have to keep winning, and eventually I will. If if they do, eventually I'll have a very respectable beard. Yeah, no, you don't shave. The, the final, mu much like the players themselves, the final shave happens on the, day, the morning before the first playoff game. And then you don't shave until your team is eliminated. Okay, there we go. I think I still went the wrong way. There's nothing left in here. He gave up though, that's neat. Looking for you is wasting valuable company time. Follow me, please. I am the company. Aha, here we go. I'm going to catch you. Or not. Why not ask me about Sebastopol's safety protocols? Okay. I think it's loudly telling me that metal detector is live, so we should go under it. Oh boy. 
I just have a feeling Karen's about to show up. Override elevator security control. Oh, I love it when you make me go to the very center of a big open room. If it, if, 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 if it looked like there was absolutely nothing I could do about that, it's because there was freaking nothing I could do about that. Just put that out there. That's some cheesy ass bullshit right there. Tell you what. But this is good to know though, the alien isn't live until we get clear of the androids, so I can freaking run if I want to. And I want to. Chances to run are so rare and fleeting. Alright. Let's start putting together an EMP mine. Let's ready our bolt gun. Alright, I don't give a shit about optional objectives and scores. I want to be nice and thorough. I have all the resources I can to kill these guys. charge pack and we're good. First guy's right there. Now that I... Now that I know there is one, I... If I can... I'd like to save at least one bolt gun shot to kill the guy with the in the uh, rubber suit. Since EMPs don't uh, work for him. I like Alien's character. It's it's Kane. He's the one who gets attacked by the face hugger. <laughs> but uh your your RIP is well received as well. There's a charge pack. All right. Okay. Yes. What are you doing here? It's about to be. It causes accidents. What are you doing here? Don't disclose its presence to any interested parties. I forgot about the third one. Hmm. All right.
exit. That must be where the third guy hangs out. Okay. Good to know, good to know. As I roll forward. You to test my patience. Oh, eat shit. Fine. Deal with you first. Why not ask me about Sebastopol safety protocols? Stuff. Keep on the and I've almost got everything I need. Go, 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 go. I'm going to catch you. All right. One more bonding agent. Frustrating, but that 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 mine should have grabbed all three. That wasn't cool. Anyway. Still, that was my bad. Still, we see the strategy now, right? Collect the parts. Build a mine. Kill those three. We should be able to be pretty leisurely at just collecting the bonus objectives and then we have to deal with Karen on our way to the actual exit. Alright. There's the first charge pack. We're still alone in here. Stay fairly quiet in here. CJ injector and one charge pack. And now I wonder why am I so obsessed with killing these guys? Why don't I try just sneaking and see how that goes? I haven't even 
I haven't even tried that option yet. It's probably much easier. It's probably what they had in mind. You know. I'm nice and quiet here. I can get a key card. Can bolt gun this douchebag. Lockdown security junction. Stromo log data in here. Hey, ZJ. No, it's not a new camera angle. Body out into space. Now, if I can just find a charge pack, or just be sneaky, I can disrupt communications back in that last room. flamethrower fuel, but there hasn't been a flamethrower. I'm not sure there is one. Alright. Stay quiet. No one's seen me yet. Be good to keep it that way. guy in this room. Our best move is just to be sneaky. Now we're safe from everybody. All of our optional objectives are done. And of course, we got Karen to deal with.
override elevator security control. Right, so I know Karen is going to show up as soon as I hit one of these terminals. There are three, apparently. I'm gonna need to hit them all. I'm gonna need to do it without getting ganked. so clingy, huh? Go find a different boyfriend. Shit, while well, she's down there right at the consoles we need to get to. somewhere else. This trolling back and forth in this room thing isn't gonna work. There we go. Get to the elevator. 
later. Oh, is it is it just gonna be that easy? I don't trust you for a second, Karen. Yep, that's what I thought. I can't tell where she is. If I didn't hear her go into the vents. Okay, she's to the right of me still. I still hear her walking around. Yeah, she's out there by the elevator. she moving so fast? What did she hear? Think she heard. I don't give a shit. We're out, baby. Free and clear. Boom. Alright, guys. Uh, I know I said we were finishing this tonight. Um, finishing the first pack is gonna have to be good enough, because like I said, I have to get up at 5 and that's in seven hours and 15 minutes but we did do an entire dlc pack tonight i think that was good so there's still more alien to play uh pd has been getting pushy lately but he he'll be disappointed but other than that i think we're gonna be fine so uh you'll see me again tomorrow night for thief um obviously i'm not gonna be on tomorrow morning because as i mentioned i'm waking up in seven hours and 15 minutes to drive down to Aurora and watch my nephew for the first half of the day. But I will be back on tomorrow night for Thief, and I hope to see most or all of you there. Sorry this was uh, shorter and less than anticipated, but, you know, I, I, think, I think an entire DLC episode is decent for a stream, right? We got that done last time, and... Uh, we did it again tonight. So, for those of you watching live on Twitch, uh, first of all, thank you so much for joining me. If you're new here and you enjoy what you're seeing, please hit the follow button so you can see the next time we go live. Uh, if you're watching later on on YouTube, don't worry, I know it can be tough to catch me live, but just subscribe to the YouTube channel. All my content eventually makes its way there, so if you go there and watch, you won't miss anything. And finally, regardless of the platform you're on, I hope you will consider joining our Discord. The link to do that is in the Twitch channel description. It is also in the YouTube video description. The Discord is the most reliable place to see my stream schedule. It's uh, <clears throat> where we can talk about the games that you want to see me play, and it's uh, just a cool uh, gathering of fun people who love video games just like you and I do. So, as I said, tomorrow night we will be on for Thief Friday. Uh, I'm looking at who's online. There's nobody I particularly feel to raid, so we'll just cut it here for tonight. And I will see you all, hopefully, 
tomorrow evening. We'll pick up Thief at my very favorite mission in the first game, The Sword. I'm excited. I hope you are too. I'll see you then.